Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist TJ Springer. With all the gloomy weather, maybe you're hoping to get out to some place that's a little brighter, a little warmer too. If you are traveling, better day today compared to the rain that we had yesterday with that storm system that was lifting up the coast. Still some clouds out there in Lancaster as we're glancing eastbound over some of the city. We're going to slowly see these diminish as drier air continues to eat away at those clouds little by little. High pressure is up to our north, so that wind flow more from the north to northwest is bringing in that drier air. There's the storm system lifting away, but we do have a little more cloud cover out to our west as we're already watching our next storm system that is going to be moving our way as we kick off the weekend. So still a somewhat unsettled stretch of weather here for us at home. 53 the current temp in Sealands Grove. We have upper 50s now from Gettysburg to Chambersburg is 57 in the capital city. We have 54 degrees in Lebanon. We are expecting temperatures to top out in the middle 50s to near 60. Definitely more sunshine later and a little breezy out there in the wake of that system tonight. We'll call it starry. It'll be chillier and with the saturated ground, the lighter breeze could have some fog out there. Temperatures fall back into the upper 30s to lower 40s. Then tomorrow we'll start the day with some sun. Clouds start to stream back in late with highs in the middle 50s to near 60. Here's predictor. We'll see that trend. Clouds continuing to erode across the valley better by the evening drive, and that's the case for dinner time as well. And with that, Starry sky and light breeze. I mentioned the fall, but we'll also have temperatures chillier through the overnight. But here come some of those clouds. Overall, nice amount of sunshine to begin our Friday, but you can see more clouds starting to work eastbound as we head through Friday evening into the overnight ahead of our uh, next storm system. So if you have plans to get out tomorrow, should be a OK. The York RV show. Not a bad idea if you're getting out to that temperature is going to get back into the upper 50s by 3 o'clock mile, but a little more cloud cover with temperatures around 52 by 8 o'clock. We're springing forward to Saturday morning and our next system is knocking on our doorstep at that point and we're going to see another nice soaking of rain as this lifts our way. It's going to be a gloomy start to our weekend just like this past weekend. Widespread rain, possibly heavy at times, but it does begin to lift out of here as we get into our Sunday. So overall, quick mover and Sunday, albeit cooler and windy, does look a bit drier. Now we are expecting temperatures to steadily rebound. Of course, remember to flip the clocks forward Saturday night before you head to bed as daylight saving time begins. 60 Tuesday, lower 60s again Wednesday. Plenty of sunshine as high pressure builds and we stay on the milder trend. We're back into the middle 60s there, Susan, as we end next week.